Hi, my name is Porter Dickey. And I'm Camille Kidwell. Here are some of this week's top stories. Chapter presidents of all national Panhellenic Conference sororities with university charters received a letter dated January 20th on behalf of their national and international sorority presidents requesting the chapters refrain from participating in the 2015 Fraternity Boys Bid Night. The university delivered its first round of Class of 2019 admissions letters on January 23rd. 4,857 applicants were offered early admission. The university is planning to release a sexual assault campus climate survey this April in collaboration with the Association of American Universities. The university says that they are doing this in an attempt to comply with the White House Task Force to protect students from sexual assault. In sports news, ESPN's College Game Day came to Charlottesville Saturday for the first time in its history to cover the UVA Duke men's basketball game. At the event, second-year student Tyler Lewis scored a half-court shot to win $18,000. The Cavaliers, 19-1, 7-1 ACC, went on to get their first loss of the season, falling to Duke, 69-63. This past weekend, the track and field team traveled to Lexington to partake in the Rod McCravey Memorial Meet. Sophomore Philippe Mahaljevic broke the school's shot putt record, throwing it 64 feet and 5 inches. Senior Peyton Hazard, sophomores Nathan Kiley and David Bartha, and freshman Logan Carrington beat the program record in the distance medley relay by three-tenths of a second. Women's basketball down NC State, 71-63 Thursday. Freshman guard Michaela Venson led the Cavaliers with 22 points. She set the program record for three-point shooting percentage, making all six of her shots from behind the arc. Thank you for watching, and please check out CavalierDaily.com or pick up a paper around grounds for further coverage about these and other stories.